If you guys are looking to buy or sell your college football 25 ultimate team coins, go over to AOEAH.com. They do all your coin business on there, boys. And using code Monty will get you 3% off of your order. Go over to AOEAH to buy or sell your coins, boys. What is going on, YouTube? And welcome back to another CFB 25 ultimate team video, man. We got some new XP objectives. We also got the content schedule. Some of you probably have seen this already, but it's better to post this better late than never boys so before we get into this video man 25 dollar gift card giveaway boys you guys all want to enter this to enter subscribe comment 300k down below and spam it boys the more you spam it the higher chances are of winning and let's get into this video man so they did not add any new milestone xp all they added was weekly xp and program weekly xp and you guys can see right here pretty fire a total of around fifteen thousand free xp so we're going to show you guys all the XP objectives first. Then we're going to show you guys the actual content schedule. We're going to post an XP method later today. Or not method, but we're going to post the best way to level up in this game right now in a little bit. But if you're watching this video, I'm going to tell you straight up. It is just playing solo seasons. And make sure you guys put these players in your lineup. Because most of these objectives, mainly all of these objectives, track in head-to-head -head or solo seasons. But some of them, and a lot of them, only track in solo seasons. So guys... I just saved you a few, like a nice five minutes of video time right there. But smash the like button on that video for you, boys, since, uh, you know, I saved you some time if you guys are goaded. But basically, guys, go ahead and run your solo season. So here are the new XP objectives win head to head games with field phenom players in your lineup. Make sure you guys have three field phenom players in your lineup. You need, a, you need six total wins with three field phenom players in your lineup for a total of 3,300. Season 2 XP. Score rushing TDs with Legends Season 2 players in your lineup. So once, a a once upon a time, Legends. Make sure you guys have three of those in your lineup. And once you guys score a total of 10 rushing touchdowns with those three rushing or Legends in your lineup, you will get a total of 3,300 Season 2 XP. Complete passes with three college kickoff players in your lineup in head-to-head -head or solo seasons. Guys, by the way, this is all in head-to-head -head or solo seasons. These do not track in solo challenges, but completing 70 passes with three college kickoff players in your lineup will get you a total of 3,300 season XP. So guys, all together, this is a total of 9,900 XP just from the program weekly objectives. And then we have these two objectives from the weekly objectives. We got achieve first downs in head to head or solo seasons. 70 total first downs get you a total of 2,700 XP and scoring rushing touchdowns score 10 rushing touchdowns in head-to-head -head or solo seasons will get you a total of 3,300 season 2 XP. So guys, all together, you're getting a total of 15,900 XP throughout these objectives. So pretty fire right here, guys. New season XP objectives. So boys, now it is time to talk about the actual content schedule. And here we go, man. I mean, copy and paste, you know, not, not much to it, boys, straight up. There is not much to it. Uh, we got stories of the week, field phenoms coming in on Wednesday at 1.30 p.m. Eastern time. We're going to get those, or not all of them, but we're going to get some of those cards revealed the night before at 8 p.m. Eastern time. So Tuesday night at 8 p.m. Eastern time, we will see like two stories of the week cards revealed. And then, like I said, it'll be released at 1.30 p.m. Eastern time on wednesday we don't get a stream for that like we just don't sadly so we won't know the rest of those cards until it's literally in the game we also have game of the week coming with stories of the week as it does every week make sure you guys log in every single wednesday and collect that game of the week token because you get a free 92 overall game of the week champion uh, sometime in late november also homecoming volume three coming in on friday a uh, pretty solid promo that honestly so far we've gotten ltd joe burrow then we got LTD Jetta. So, you know, off the top of my head, I'm just going to assume we're getting LTD Chase this week. You know, we got those three free cards. If you win 70 games in the house rules, you get a free 90 overall Chase, Jetta, or Burrow. Not end, it's or. So you get one of those free three for free. And um, they're also now LTD. So like I said, we got 91 Burrow, 91 Jetta. Now we're going to get a 91 overall Chase LTD coming in this week. I don't know what the 90 overalls are going to be. Those are current day college football players, which is pretty cool. 
But uh, yeah, man, we're gonna just gonna have to wait and see. But Homecoming Volume 3 coming in on Friday, 1.30 p.m. Eastern Time, but there is a stream that day, 10.30 a.m., or actually 11 a.m. Eastern Time. That is October 11th, guys. That is on Friday. So October 11th, 11.30 a.m. Eastern Time, we will see the Homecoming content reveal. But like they always do, the night before, Thursday night, 8 p.m. Eastern Time, they're gonna reveal two of those Homecoming cards. So we will see two of those Homecoming cards revealed then the stream in the morning, then the content at 1.30. And then Legends revealed at 8 p.m. Eastern Time on Saturday night. That content will be released 10.30 a.m. Eastern Time on Sunday. So boys, that is pretty much it for this video. Let me know what you guys think of this week's content schedule. And go and give your boy a follow on the Twitter as well, at PaulMon13. All of the links to all of my socials in the description below. But that is pretty much it for this video, boys. Thank you guys for watching. We got another vid for you in a little bit. Peace.